1 to 10 Squirrel's Bad Day by Carol P. Roman is about Squirrel. <laughs> um, the book starts off, it's kind of like, um, I would say comic book like, and that's kind of cute. Here, I'll just show you quickly. You know, there's very simple, you know, pictures, simple words, and the book starts off in more of a comic fashion. It's more clear here. And the kids did enjoy, you know, the picture, and they kind of have to put the pieces together. And that was really cute. And the book basically is about Squirrel, and Squirrel, poor little thing, is having a really bad day. He lost his acorn, and he's just frustrated. And then along comes his good friend, and his friend kind of gives him some strategies, and then, you know, brings together all of his other friends. And together they figure out, you know, the right and wrong thing and how to act and feel. And what I love about this book is that, you know, from a kid's perspective, kids in general, you know, they know nothing um, as far as, you know, what we know. <laughs> Obviously, they're kids and we're grown-ups and they have not lived as long. But kids are trying to navigate an adult world and sometimes they need a little bit boost, a little bit of help. And this book kind of gives the kids the tools they need to evaluate their situation and figure out, well, is my life that bad? Is the situation that bad? Um, it, it does teach a trick called, well, you can call it the 1 to 10 trick, and it's just a really, really, really useful strategy for kids to just learn coping skills, and, you know, Squirrel is a very fun, friendly character, and all these characters actually bring in something different. Some of their um, 1 to 10 examples are really bad and they should be sad and would make any kid sad and some of them at first the kids may feel sad and mad or however they feel but then through evaluating the whole situation they realize well you know what maybe it's not as bad as they make it out to be and this skill is really really important for kids to learn and this book kind of introduces it in a really really fun way. So I would definitely recommend this book. In addition, we have a surprise giveaway. One of you lucky super duper video watchers will, or bloggers, will, you know, viewers, will be getting a free copy of this book. This reminds you, 1 to 10 Squirrels Bad Day. It is a great book for kids. It does teach them such amazing, amazing coping skills, communication skills, evaluating skills. In addition, if you check out the links below, not only will you find the direct link to this video, because unfortunately there's only one winner, everyone should purchase this book, but you will also find, I do have something that, you know, an idea in my blog post, which I will leave the link to that below, on a way that you can actually make this book come to life and, you know, give your kids something more tangible and help them when they're having a bad day. So, let's just remind you, free book giveaway, and who doesn't like free and book, especially for kids, free activity in the blog link below, and if you like this video and want to see more, definitely subscribe, let me know what you think, like, and just I want to hear from you, I want to hear, you know, what makes your kids happy, because remember, I'm here for my kids, for your kids, for the kids in my play-based education program, and in my opinion, one of the best ways to get kids, you know, educated is through good quality literature, and one to ten squirrels bad day right over here is definitely a good piece of literature that your kids will enjoy. Happy playing and happy reading.